Uh-oh. My sadness detectors are through the roof. Ooh, my poor sweetie. Hmm, let's see. You're not really reacting to me. Just kind of laying here. You look tired, but you can't sleep. <laughs> I'm assuming you can't sleep because you've kind of just been laying here for a while. You must have had a really exhausting day. Maybe I can help. Uh, nothing. I'm not planning anything. I just... I guess I could cuddle you if you want me to. I'm just... I'm so busy. But I can make time for you. <laughs> oh, okay. I was worried you were gonna say you needed personal space or something. Now if we can just, uh... I'll just lay like this. Mm-hmm. I'll be your blanket. A very cuddly, loving, cute blanket. <laughs> I'm just being so close to you, like a blanket should. I'm already feeling so much better. Oh, right, but, um, this moment we're focusing on you. Come on, sweetie. Tell your loving, wonderful, amazing girlfriend all about your troubles. Oh, just a terrible day. That's awful. An entire day being terrible. That's really sad. Hmm. You know, I think you're so wonderful. Mm hmm. Every time I get close to you and I get to cuddle you, oh, I feel so magical. Because you are really nice to cuddle. And you're so cute. I mean, from a distance, you're already so attractive. But being this close to you, uh, it really melts my heart. <laughs> it's like you're, you're a pan. And my heart is made of butter. And you're melting my heart for a recipe. A recipe of love. <laughs> Let me just get closer. As close as I can be. Or I can scoot back a little, that's fine. <laughs> but still close enough to cuddle you. I really do think you're wonderful. Oh, and don't even get me started on your personality. So kind and, and thoughtful, and you are just so hard working. Huh. If there was such a thing as a perfect person, I would think that would be you. Although, through my eyes, I don't see any flaws. You're just perfection. <laughs> of course, I think you're hard working. You do everything, and I try to help a little, <laughs> but you, you just do so much, and it's really inspiring. What do you mean? <laughs> Sweetie, taking the time to relax and unwind, especially when you're sad, that doesn't mean you're not a hard worker. It means you're responsible. Taking care of your mental needs. Oh, that's so attractive. Someone who pays attention to their health. Who knows what their brain needs. Oh, I just love you. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm calm. <laughs> when I think about you, 
and how wonderful you are. I just get a little crazy in love. But I'm not crazy, I promise. I'm respectful. Oh, but I love you. Okay, sweetie. What I'm about to tell you may sound like a lie, but it's not. I think you are the most perfect, perfectest, perfect person to ever, to ever be perfect. Even if perfection isn't real, I think you're perfect. Everything about you, just... Every day I fall more and more in love with you. And if it was possible, I would hold on to you forever. <laughs> you just make me so happy. Even when you're sad, I'm so happy that you're able to lay down and, and know that you need to relax. Hmm. You know what the most perfectest person perfect to ever perfect of a person deserves? Forget what I said. I know it, it was confusing. <laughs> but do you know what the most perfect person deserves? A pie. I'm gonna make you a pie. A surprise pie. It could be anything. Maybe apple pie. Or blueberry. Or chocolate. Or... It'll be a surprise. And it'll all be for you. And me. <laughs> I love pie. But, um... It'll mainly be for you. Of course you deserve pie. Sweetie, look at me. You deserve everything. <laughs> and I wish I could give you everything. But sadly, I can't. But the least I can do is make you a pie. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be a surprise. <laughs> because I don't really know what I want to make yet. And although apple pie is my favorite, I'm willing to make something else. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe it'll have multiple fruits. Yes, I can make the most bestest, amazingest pie. Anything for you, my love. Well, sure it'll taste good. I mean, you cook different pies differently, I think. But I'll make it all work out. And you'll be happy. Or at least your tongue will be happy. Because of all the flavors. And even if you're not happy, that's gonna be okay. Because you can just relax here. I can go get you a blanket. Mm -hmm. And you can watch something. You can just take it easy. While I make us a wonderful pie. Sweetie, don't you ever say that. Of course you deserve to relax. I will not have you be mean to yourself. <sighs> Looks like I'm gonna have to give you more cuddles. Really show you all the love that you deserve. <laughs> mm -mm. I'm not gonna let go until you promise to be nicer to yourself. So, do you promise to be nicer to yourself? Oh, <laughs> That was easier than I thought. I guess I don't have to keep cuddling you. <laughs> but you're so comfortable. Oh, wait, I need to go get the blanket. And then make us a pie. And you? You relax. Or you try to. Because you deserve it. Even if you didn't do much today, that's fine. There are days where I do absolutely nothing, because my brain feels just, oh, it's just too much. And then I realize 
I deserve to relax. To forget about my brain for a moment. And if I can realize that about myself, I can realize that about you. So, no matter what you've done today, a lot or not much, you still deserve to relax. So get comfortable. I'm gonna go get that blanket. And then, we shall have pie.